Hey, what's up everyone? Welcome back to another video. In this video, we're going to go over my experience doing the PJPT from TCM Security. If you guys haven't heard of it, don't worry. I'm sure you have, but I want to go over my experience and what I did to prepare for this and how long it took and all that good stuff, all the questions and all the great comments I got on LinkedIn when I announced that I passed. I want to say thank you from the bottom of my heart. I really appreciate the support. So let's get into the video and have some fun. All right, folks, so here is my journey onto the PJPT exam and what I did to prepare, how long it took me to take the exam and why I did it on Memorial Day weekend. I wanna answer all those questions and I got so many questions and so many comments on LinkedIn and on Instagram. And I wanna say thank you to TCM Security for having such an awesome exam for beginners and for allowing me to take this exam. So I really appreciate it. Thanks to Heath Adams, to Joe, both Joes over there. And uh, if anyone's watching this from TCM or the TCM Discord, I had a funny question yesterday because I submitted my results or before I submitted my my report, you know, you have to submit your report to, to see if you passed or failed. I asked the question, how long did it take? I don't use Discord. I'm not a Discord user. People are saying I had it since 2019. I had sneakers from fucking 2003 that I wore two times. Does that, you know, just because I have something doesn't mean I'm using it, right? So I just want to put that out there. And uh, so thank you for all the support. And I want to thank Cyberman that's, you know, doing support for TCM. So thank you so much, dude. I really appreciate you. So let's get into all this fun stuff for the PJPT, right? <coughs> Excuse me. So learn how to hack, then prove it. This is pretty much this exam, right? You're doing an internal assessment. The PNPT is you have an external perimeter and you get your way into a perimeter. And I think you do the same kind of concept when you do in a PJPT, but you're doing that from the external perimeter first, I believe. I haven't taken the PMPT yet. Hope that's next. But here we have, if you go to TCM security, you know, certifications.tcm-sec.com, you'll see the PJPT. And what is the PJPT exam, right? So you have two days to complete the exam, and then you have two days to write a professional report. How long did this take me? I'm gonna be realistic. Studying for it, I didn't really study that much. I'm gonna be honest. I, you know, I had a, I had a few friends that actually failed this, and they had OSCP, OS, other stuff that, you know, I don't even see my, you know, OSWEs and all this, all this shit from OFSEC. And I had two people that had OSEP, experienced professional, and they failed this. I'm not gonna put any names out there, but I was like, oh shit, <laughs> you know? Cause I'm not doing penetration testing every single day of my life, right? And I'm just gonna put that out there. So when I got, you know, the voucher for this, I was nervous. I was like, should I study? Should I not study? You know, should I just fucking wing it? So what I did, what Patrick Gorman did, I went through the AD section of the PEH course, right? And I set up my own little lab, just like Heath said. All I gotta say is if you follow his steps, you're done, you're good. You know, you don't have to do anything else. You don't have to go fucking do hack the box, try hack me's, you know, any, anything else. Just that's what's so awesome about TCM. You know, what they teach you is what they present on the exam, right? That's all I got to say. So how long did it take me to compromise it? It took me 42 minutes, right? I, I did a timer. So once I hit start the exam and to compromise the domain to do all the steps that, they, that you need to do, it took me 42 minutes. And that was because I took a few extra steps. If I wanted to go straight to it, I could have probably done it in 25 to 30 minutes. I'm not saying that to toot my horn. I'm not the best pen tester. There's way better people than me, but I followed my methodology, right? I did exactly what Heath Adams said. You know, <laughs> take these notes, learn these commands, and you should be good. Literally, that's what I did. So 43 minutes, I, I always say an hour just to round it off, but I actually had a timer 
when I was doing it and it took me 42 minutes to get DA, right? And then to write the report, that was a bitch. I'm not good at writing reports, so I took, uh, I went to GitHub off of uh, Heath Adams or TC, you know, the Cyber Mentor and got his report and I just made some mods and I just put some of my screenshots in. That's one thing. <clears throat> Make sure you take a lot of screenshots. That's probably what I practiced before taking the exam because, and one other thing, this is not a CTF, right? So you know how CTFs, you, you know, you run your Nmap scan and then you just, you look at the vulnerable ports and you do this. If you have that mindset, you're fucked. That's all I gotta say, don't do that. Go in, it, go in there like an internal assessment, right? That's what you have to do. And that's why I think my buddies failed because they went in there, because you know, like the OSCP back then when they did it, it was very CTF-y, right? This is not a CTF. That's one thing I love about how Heath has this shit set up. You know, that was it. So the report, I know I'm yap, you know, yapping. I wanna just make sure I get all those points across because I got a lot of questions. So to, for the um, report, once I downloaded it, I just made some modifications and it took me about two and a half hours, three hours to do the report, right? And that's just because, you know, I've done reports before. I'm not the best at them, but I know, you know, how to do them. And how Heath Adams has the, how, how he has the uh, report, the template. And if you go, if you don't know, you should, if you're doing the, PEH course, just put a TCM pen test report. And it's right on his GitHub. So right here, if you go to his GitHub, it's right here, the two year old one. If you download this, this Word doc, and you should be golden, right? I have this on my local machine and I'm not gonna open it up because it's not like that anymore. It's about the exam. So I'm not getting punched in the head from Heath or from anyone else. So I'm not going to do that. All right. So what you're going to be doing is leveraging their Active Directory environment. You're going to perform a compromise. You're going to perform a lateral movement into their network, right? And ultimately compromise the domain, right? So, and then you have to write the report that proves what you did, right? And I really, really like this. And I can't wait to now to take the PMPT. Now I think doing this, you know, people said I could have just took the PMPT, but I don't like to underestimate any exams, right? I, I don't, I, I went into the A plus fucking 20 years ago and that was probably the hardest exam I still take. I, I've still, you know, I took in my whole career. I always say that because I hate com fucking computers. But um, so who is this program for, right? you know, for IT folks, for inspiring ethical hackers, cybersecurity professionals, et cetera, et cetera, right? So, yeah, let me see, uh, bah, 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 bah. So this is uh, the PEH course, you're gonna, you know, learn all about this fun stuff. And like I said, all I did was the Active Directory pen testing training. And that's, you know, I, I, I just did the lab setup, I did what he said, and I took thorough notes and that was it, right? So, you know, all the students reviews, blah, blah, blah. It's a realistic exam. Yes, it is. Thank God I don't have to take a, you know, retake it. So, um, you know, God forbid you do fail. They give you the chance to do it again. You can beat it. I really enjoy, I actually had some fun doing this exam. I had a little, you know, once I hit start the exam, I had some nerves going, but after I started settling in, settling in I was like, all right, bet. This is pretty cool. All right, so... That's about that. That's about it. So this is obviously the PEH course, the practical ethical hacking course. If you guys don't have this, you know, I would recommend getting your hands on this course if you're looking to do the PJPT. If you're going to do PMPT, that's obviously you have to do some OSINT, lateral movement. You have to probably do more, which I'm going to be starting. Today is Memorial Day. So if there's any, you know, veterans out there, thank you for your service. And thank you, Heath, for your service because I know you were in i think the military if i believe so kudos dude thank you <clears throat> so um if i come down here so you're going to learn so much stuff you can just go on their site academy.tcm-sec and uh, if you want to get all access and all that stuff so that's pretty much it right for the pmpt 
what I took out of this was take your time. You know, I I did zip through it. Once I completed it, I went back and I was trying to see if there's any other ways in, right, into the domain. So just take your time. However you, you know, there's a million ways to skin a cat. However you compromise the domain, that's your that's your business. But I have to say this was well worth it. Well worth a three-day weekend. I thought I was going to need probably a day and a half to do the exam. Because like I said, I'm not doing this every single day right now. But after, you know, after a few, after a few minutes, I, I was like, this is, this is it. I, I think I could do this pretty quickly. So the PMPT, I don't think I'm going to do it. <laughs> I want to do it in an hour, maybe even a couple hours. Um, that's probably going to take a lot longer. But this is for the PJPT and I really enjoyed it. I, I don't know how, ex how else to express that. So yeah, if you have any questions that you want me to answer for this exam, obviously, you know, all I got to say is, you know, just do your PEH course. You know, if you want to do the, you know, soup to nuts, go for it. But for this specific exam, all you need is the Active Directory section. And, you know, again, thank you for all the love and support on Discord. And for the ones that were a uh, little, little bit of an asshole, you know, don't be a dick. Next time, you know, when, when I said you guys don't know me, don't know me meaning like I don't go on fucking these Discord servers. I don't hang out like a nerd. I'm not one of those kind of people that just like to be on the computer and be an internet gangster, right? I just like, I was just asking a simple question. You could have just said, you know, it all depends or whatever. But, you know, that's behind me. I just want to put that out there because, you know, you don't have to be a stickler. <laughs> you know what I mean? You don't have to be fucking right by the books and be a dick. Next time, you know, what if I was totally new and I don't know how to use Discord? You know, even if I was in it for 2019 until 2019, like I said, I have sneakers probably older than these kids that were riding that shit. But, um... That's pretty much it. That's all I want to do is just get on here. I'm yapping now and give my experience about the PJPT. And uh, I think I answered, I didn't really study, uh, like I said, for the for the actual Active Directory section, me taking notes, I think I did that in a night. One night I just said, you know, I'm going to study for it. I want to create, ex uh, create the lab and go through some of the attacks in my lab, like Heath Adams goes through. And I did that probably two or three times just to make sure I'm familiar with the commands and make sure all my tools work. That's another thing. Make sure you're all up to date. Make sure all your tools are working, whatever you're going to use to perform your exam. Because when I was doing my lab, some of the impacted tools weren't working. You know, so as long as you have like Pimp My Cali, download, install Pimp My Cali on your Linux box or your Cali box. And that's pretty much it. Like after, you know, if you want to have any you know, any other cool tools, you know, go for it. But it's, it's, uh, it's fun. Just enjoy your time. Two days is well, well enough time. You know, you know, you could probably do it if you're a complete beginner. Like if you went through that course, you could probably do it in a day. So, you know, my recommendations maybe start on a Saturday morning. I don't know. I work better in the mornings. So do it in the morning and, and go for it and see. And obviously if you need a, if you need a disconnect, you know, like take a walk around, go take a bite to eat, get some sleep or whatever. And uh, that's it. That's it for me. So thank you, TCM Security, for this opportunity. And hopefully I get the PMPT and I give a better uh, review because that'll be a little more uh, experience or mid-level. But the junior level one was definitely a fun exam. So thank you. Until next time, I'll see you guys in the next one.